Let's do one more problem using that same reaction, but this time let's do the full stoichiometry. Let's find the limiting reactant and let's use the limiting reactant to determine the answer. So if we're given 125 grams of ethanol and 210 grams of oxygen, we should be able to determine how much energy will be released. So whenever doing stoichiometry, our first step is to balance the equation, which has been done for us. And our second step is to convert to moles. Let's start with 125 grams of ethanol. I know that one mole is going to be equivalent to 46.06 grams. So as always, we can cancel out units. So my grams go away. And I'm going to be left with 2.71 moles of ethanol. Now let's do the same thing with the oxygen. I have 210 grams of O2 and I know the molar mass is 32 grams for every one mole of oxygen and I get 6.56 .6 moles of O2. We can again check our work because the grams cancel out and I'm left with moles. So now I've converted the moles. The next step would be to determine the limiting reactant. So this is when I use that if-then statement. I'll pick a reactant, so let's pick the ethanol. I'll say if I have 2.71 moles of ethanol, then I need, well there's three oxygens for every one ethanol. So that means you need 8.13 moles of oxygen. And if you take a look, you don't have 8.13 moles of oxygen. You only have 6.56 .6 moles of oxygen. So that makes this the limiting reactant. And that means you have an excess of ethanol. So now that we know what our limiting reactant is, we can use our limiting reactant to determine the product, or in this case, we can use the limiting reactant to determine how much energy would be released. So I'm going to take 6.56 moles of oxygen, that's how much oxygen we actually have, and I'm going to set the ratio of 1,371 kilojoules for every three moles of oxygen. Cancel out the moles of oxygen, and we get 2,997 kilojoules. Now that's a lot of sig figs. So if I'm going to write this in three sig figs, I would say 3,000 kilojoules. That's only one sig fig. So to really be specific, I would say 3.00 times 10 to the 3 kilojoules.